Thank you. Uh, I think this is a great subject, especially uh, with the changing um, life uh, circumstances, uh -huh. uh, emergence of uh, technology, uh, increasing urbanization, uh, crime rates, and all social, you know, network breakdown like nuclear families. Uh, values and systems. Uh, we now need to begin to think about children as uh, components of our society, and and so vulnerable children are children who are exposed, mm -hmm. and um, um, their their development is at risk. Uh, we we call them adverse childhood experiences. They are literally children who are exposed to a wide array of experiences in early years that can advance their development. Mm -hmm. And uh, from, from science, uh, the brain develops rapidly between about zero to um, two years, maybe three years, but by the time they get to six years, a child development is about 80% fully developed. Mm -hmm. So any experiences, um, uh, traumatic experiences, uh, exposure to filings, uh, death, you know, death of a loved one, uh, children, parents, uh, migration. You know, I like to encourage people that we need to think about children as, you know, part and parcel of our society. When, for example, you make a decision to move from one house to another, yes. or one neighborhood to another, for for whatever reason, as an adult, adult, your thinking is important. You know, you need to think about the perspective of children. And sometimes you, know. you don't even think it's important. Yeah.